Hi all, welcome to the best of cat series by IMS. Today we are going to look at the questions on logarithm and kindly give it a try, pause the video and then resume the video. So in this sum, it is given that x is a real number such that log of 5 to the base 3 is equal to log of 2 plus x to the base 5, then which of the following basically is going to be true over here. Now there can be a couple of methods to solve this particular question. Many of you let's say if you know the value of log of 2, log of 3, so log of 2 is known to us as 0.3010 log of let's say 3 happens to be a 0.4771 so no one really knows what's the value of log of pi to the base 3 but this part if i look at one can find as log of 5 divided by log 3 and log of pi basically one can write as log of 10 by 2 which is log of 10 minus log of 2 so log 10 happens to be 1 so 1 minus 0 0.3010 upon 0 0.4771. This is one way in which you can possibly calculate the value of let's say log pi to the base 3 which will definitely going to be nearly equals to a 0 0.7 divided by 0 0.4771. So approximately 1.5 I don't want to calculate the value of uh, this particular expression log of pi to the base 3. So what could be the best possible approach? So instead of let's say finding out the value of log 2 and log 5, what we can understand is that if I have log 3 to the base 3, this value is known to us, it has to be equals to 1. Can we say log of 9 to the base 3 will be equal to a 2, since 9 happened to be nothing but 3 square. So we get 2 times of log 3 to the base 3 giving us 2 into 1 which is equals to 2. So can we say one thing here that log of 5 to the base 3 is going to be between the two numbers which are more than log 3 base 3 and less than log of 9 to the base 3. So which would mean that the value of log 5 to the base 3 will be between the number 1 and 2 for sure. And then can we replace the term log 5 to the base 3 by the expression which is log of 2 plus x uh, base 5. So, one can say log of 2 plus x base 5 will be between 1 and 2. Then if I know the basic property of logarithm that if you have log of a to the base b is equals to n, then the value of a will be nothing but b raised to n. So, in this particular case, can we say that the term 2 plus x should be between 5 raised to 1 and 5 raised to 2, which means between the number 5 and 25. So if I subtract 2 on both sides, 1 will get 5 minus 2 as 3, 25 minus 2 as a 23. So the value of x will be in the interval 3 to 23. And then if I look at the option choices, I can clearly mark option number 4 as my answer for this particular question. So a nice problem. And now once you have understood this particular method, you can give a try to the replica question and put your answer in the comment section.